We were at the car wash yesterday cleaning up the RC, but we cleaned the body on the outside. It's still filthy on the inside, but that's not a big deal. Various stickers, keep the bitch floored, motorcycle museum, which is actually closing. This is another body from Mr. Painter. It's themed after my monster truck on Forza. It's a Tonka body, Tonka X Max, Fallout 4 stickers, Mr. Painter logo, um, WFO gears. These gears are 200 bucks for them. They're very heavy duty. Castle 2048, um, censored ESC, 4500 RPM max, and this motor is the size of a pop can. You've seen an Apple Watch or an Apple Watch Ultra. Look at that big motor. Castle XL2 um, ESC running off of two Gen Zace bashing um, LiPos. 8S, 60 mile per hour. We're not gonna do 60 because big event. Another thing is, um, the pinion, which is this right here. I'm having an issue where it does not like to stay on here. I have orange thread locker on it because the blue keeps failing, but we'll see. Hopefully it'll last. If not, we'll have to, it'll be done because we, we it takes 24 hours to dry, but we're waiting on my buddy, Michael coming here from work. We'll meet up with him in a little bit here, but for now we're just gonna chill, enjoy the nice day and watch some, um, racing and i want to give a big shout out to my buddy cobra built media with his cobra follow him on facebook instagram at cobra built media got the udr x max is in the back udr has lights on it and actually a functional brake light so we're going to run that got the new mr painter king off-road racing shocks body all done up um most a lot of vitivon parts scale king shocks scale king stickers um yeah. First gen Ram. Hey, it's a low gear. Barely on the trigger. Okay, that I kind of made that look easy. How's it going, John? Good. Hey, thanks for coming out. Yeah, absolutely. All right, we, it's getting windy. It's raining a little bit. We found Cody. Cody, say hi to my vlog. People are kind of packing up, but at the same time, it's just kind of what you call a rain panic. We got um, some guy on Monster and um, Cocaine doing donuts in a van. That's the most old school car I've ever seen. It's that um, that vehicle from SnowRunner. And though they, they have one like that in the original Mud Runner, they have one. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. I love the Galaxy 500s. Currently, it is raining. People are kind of bailing. Got our rain jackets. I wish I could flip this around and show you. Cody's gonna maybe leave. Um, part of my language, but it's gonna be a literal shit show. They're raining, they're putting water on the track and it's raining.
Minnesota, my buddy, he almost lost the city in Vermont.
The other one, I think it's a Hyundai or a Neon. guy was wasted and he was twerking in the, the fire. He walked up and was twerking.
So as the Torque Fest day one comes to an end, I leave you with the UDR. So we're gonna have a little update here. So this is my receiver. There's another slash right there. This is the remote you guys saw me using yesterday. And the problem I'm having is, so this has a touch screen right here. And this was in the, it's supposed to be IP rated like a phone. This is not responding. I can go down, but to go, I have to switch between, I was running the X Max yesterday. So I have to switch, which is this from this, one of these like, like the X Max has to this one. You have to press up like this and it's not responding to go up. So what we have to do is we have to take this out, put the one that's in here in this one and bind this remote to that receiver. Burning daylight, my buddy Michael is here. Um, Cody is here, Craig. Um, shout out to Keegan Youthy, shout out to Shannon Duggan, shout out to Brett. I give them props, but they got the wrong tail lights. They got the 68 tail lights on it. I, I don't understand that. They have a 68 tail lights with a 69 front end. Amongst all the stuff, we have that. People leaving, people dressing up like from the 50s. So it's moving backwards. I'm not touching it. Come on. Always a fun time with the Slash at Vintage Torque Fest. It's a little boy, we're gonna flip around and do a flyby. Update, had some food. People leaving, there's a storm kind of by Des Moines that is not quite here yet, but it's way over there. Got a Cobra. Very nice. Try it one more time. Are we gonna get this? Who's gonna wreck again? Kind of, kind of, not quite what I wanted, but. So I believe in giving people the benefit of the doubt here, but right here, this uh, galaxy comes over the hill, the nearly hits doing, me, me off the road runs like that. my RC off the road. Like, wouldn't you assume you're at a festival and you can't see, so you would get off to the one side? Regardless, you could see him coming over and he just stayed over this way towards where I'm walking. Why do I buy a Subaru with symmetrical all-wheel drive? All right, let's get out of here. No, 
it's sliding. Oh, it's sliding indeed. Oh yeah, we're getting sideways. And there it goes, it's kicking out. Well, maybe. it yeah. was a good torque fest. It wasn't my favorite year. Other years were better. There was no burnouts. I had fun, though. I saw a lot of cool things. I look forward to the 2024 torque fest. I don't know when it will be. Um, aside from almost getting hit by a car, people yelling at me, and, yeah, just different things. I leave you with my Forester driving on a soupy road behind the racetrack. Enjoy. Catch you guys next year.